Welcome back to the channel. This, as always, is the one I want. And as you can see, guys, we are back once again with even more 2K16 news. Now, we do have a few cool different bits to cover today, so let's just get straight into it. Now, let's start this off with the bigger news of the day. So, since the My Career Gameplay trailer was released a couple of days ago, people have been asking if this year's My Career mode is going to be available on the last gen systems. Well, we now have that news because 2K have officially confirmed that the 2K16 Micro Mode will be a PS4 and Xbox One exclusive and not be on the last gen systems. Now, I think most of us saw this coming in fairness. They said last year the Micro Mode wasn't doable on last gen and on this year's version only expanded. It was never realistically going to be on the older consoles. Unfortunate news for any last gen users, but still some official confirmation nonetheless that this year's 2K16 Micro Mode will not be featured on the PS3 or Xbox 360. Yesterday, the 2K Dev channel released some more brand new gameplay, this time showcasing some new manager footage. Now the clips show some really cool manager animations, for example sliding a weapon into the ring, distracting the opposing superstar on the apron and best of all pulling the referee out of the ring. Now I think these are awesome, might actually give us a fun reason to play as a manager in the games, but only that, pretty handy for universe mode and micro storylines, so a massive thumbs up from me, a great new feature, i link to that video if you haven't seen it yet in the description of this one. Now we've also got some news on Cody Rose and wrestlers that wear masks in the game. We know that Stardust is of course already confirmed for 2K16, but when 2K were asked if Cody Rhodes as himself would also be on the game, maybe as an alternative attire for Stardust, 2K confirmed that he wouldn't be and stated the following. We requested to have Cody Rhodes in 2K16, but it was not approved by the WWE. Much like the masked wrestlers, the WWE doesn't like to mix personas of active roster superstars and divas. If the alternate persona is from long enough ago, then we sometimes are allowed to include the alternate persona, but in the recent history, that is not generally allowed. So we now know that Cody Rhodes as himself will not be in this year's game, and also 2K went on to confirm via this message that aside from certain superstars like Kane and Mankind, Generally speaking, you will not be able to remove superstar masks in 2K16. And finally, not necessarily brand new info, but a little note coming out of this past Monday's new trailer. During the trailer, you can see DDP deliver a diamond cutter to Bam Bam Bigelow. Now, if you pause that shot and zoom in, you can see the featured arena, which is the WCW Bash at the Beach arena. So, WCW Bash at the Beach, presumably the 1994 version which featured Austin vs Steamboat, is confirmed for 2K16, so passing that along for anyone that hadn't seen that previously. So yeah guys, that is it for today's 2K16 news, but plenty of cool bits and pieces, so be sure to let me know your thoughts on the featured news as a comment in the comment section below. As always, stay tuned to this channel for plenty more 2K16 videos coming very soon. And also, be sure to check out the series playlist for any videos you might have missed. A link on the screen. And until next time, this has been 101. And I will see you all on the next one.